Kathleen O'Reilly was a traveler, artist, and socialite, and her bedroom reflects these traits of her personality. Though she spent much time abroad, volunteering, sightseeing, and attending school, Kathleen occupied this room for the majority of her life. Situated just off the front hall, Kathleen would have used this room as her primary entertaining space, where friends might join her for tea and conversation. Kathleen's room is in the oldest part of the house, constructed in 1862. In 1884, this room, along with the drawing room, were enlarged by the O'Reilly family. Today, the bedroom is quite spacious, with a window providing a picturesque view toward the North Gardens, Woodland Walk, and the Gorge Waterway beyond. Like most rooms in the house, Kathleen's bedroom was equipped with a fireplace and a set of warming cupboards, where towels and linen were stored when not in use. A washstand and a small vanity would have acted similarly to a modern bathroom counter. We can imagine this was where Kathleen brushed her hair, applied rouge to her cheeks, and made any final touches to her appearance before entertaining guests. As Kathleen was a lifelong occupant of Point Ellis House, this space is filled with her belongings. Her clothing, embroidery, perfume, and original artworks have all become part of the Point Ellis House collection and are available for visitors to the site to view today.